Alrighty, what's going on everybody? It's your boy, CoolGobi149, and today I'm here to show you how to fix the You Do Not Have Access bug on the EA Play Store. Now, I have noticed this bug with Jedi Fallen Order, and if you have this bug with other games, um, I'm going to go through the trouble shooting, um, shooting steps to try to find uh, the issue. So, uh, the solution that I found... Um, is quite stupid, to be honest with you. Um, but uh, it's the only solution I found for me. Uh, but I'll give you all the steps that I went through that, to see if it would help you. So first of all, um, here is the bug, if you do not know. Uh, you mu This bug that I'm going to fix or show you a workaround for only happens when you own it on a separate platform. So if you own Jedi Fallen Order or a game with a DLC on Epic Games or Steam, then this bug might occur. So, let's say you hit play on Epic Games, which it doesn't matter where you hit play, you can hit it on Epic Games, or you can hit it on uh, EA Play. Uh, you'll see this screen come up, and usually, pretty quickly after this comes up, the game should open up, but uh, this will stay for a really long time, or I think it's like 30 seconds to be exact. Uh, so we'll wait a moment, let it go through, and I'll explain a little bit more as it goes on. Uh, once this goes through, you'll get an error message that says you do not have access to this game, saying that you either own it on a different account. Here we go. Uh, the title may have been downloaded to your device by another user who owns the game. Log into a different account or restart the app to try again. So you must restart the app if you want to try it again. And no matter how many times you reset, this will not work. Because this isn't the correct version of Jedi Fallen Order, if you own the deluxe version. So first of all, let me just say, if you do have multiple EA accounts, make sure you have checked all of them. Your, um, crap, I forgot the name of it. Origin, yeah. Your Origin account is your EA account. So sign into the correct Origin account using EA Play, and you should have Jedi Fallen Order playable. Now, if you still can't play it there, make sure you're on the correct account on EA, on Epic Games or Steam. If you are on the correct account and you click on the game here or on EA Play and it's giving you that bug, um, my workaround was to go to the browse page, search up Jedi Fallen Order, or in my instance, I just search up Jedi. Um, all of these items will come up. You will scroll down to the bottom where it says add-ons. You will click on add-ons and you will click play. The reason this bug happens is because when you try loading right here in your collection, this version of Jedi Fallen Order, it will try loading the original version of Jedi Fallen Order and not the deluxe edition, which is the one that was sold on the Epic Games and Steam. Um, and when that happens, it will not load. Well, when you try to play it, it will not load because you don't own the standard edition. You own the deluxe edition. And again, this is only if you own the deluxe version edition. If you only own the standard and this is not working, uh, I cannot help. But the me method that I found to get around it is you search up Jedi in Browse. You scroll down to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Uh, and then you click play. It doesn't even have a title card. But when you click play, the game will open. So, um, this is definitely a bug. I have never bought the standard edition for the game. I've only owned the deluxe, and with Origin, I could click the standard edition, and it would automatically open the deluxe. So, this is a bug on EA's end, and they do need to fix this. So, and I am sending this, uh, my YouTube link to EA. So, if you're an EA, uh, support person, and you're watching this video, please find a fix for this. For the, uh, for the players who own Jedi Fallen Order, because this will cause a lot of confusion, and, um, and it is a bug on your end. This is, this is not supposed to happen, because, it, of course, I'm about to show you I own the game, so clicking play should allow me to play the game I own. Uh, but anyways, thank you so much for watching. If this helped you guys, uh, I appreciate, I'm glad I could help, uh, but if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Um, thank you so much, and have an awesome day.